54,000 veterans. That's the number of new patients uncovered today who are enrolled in the VA health care system who had asked to see a doctor but never got an appointment. The alarming numbers come from an internal audit of the VA health care system released just today. This is the latest chapter in a nationwide scandal that has placed our San Antonio VA hospital definitely in the spotlight. News 4 troubleshooter Stacy Cameron has been pouring through the data in this 54-page report to find out what it means for veterans here in Texas. Acting VA Secretary Sloan Gibson promised the report on Friday. We're not perfect here. Uh, we've got some access challenges here. Today, the agency delivered the audit, which paints a troubling picture. Most alarming, the discovery of almost 3,000 new Texas veterans enrolled in the VA health care system, unable to get appointments. So at this point, we feel that we have the resources, we can meet the need. That's Mary Weldon, director of the VA system in San Antonio, speaking Friday about how well the system here operates. But according to the audit, 837 patients are waiting to see a doctor in her medical facilities. Veterans who've been enrolled in the VA health care system for a decade. This audit reveals a lack of timely care for too many veterans. Representative Lloyd Doggett wasn't the only Texas lawmaker outraged by the audit. In a statement, Congressman Lamar Smith calls the findings inexcusable. Senator John Cornyn is calling for an FBI investigation. Both Democrats and Republicans say it's a scandal that offends the men and women who have served our country. That number is too big, and we need to get it reduced in having the resources at the VA and the management to see that our veterans get quicker care. The audit also found VA staff admitting they use unapproved systems and methods to track patients needing appointments. For that reason, San Antonio and seven other VA systems in Texas are now subject to further investigation.